Not gonna lie. Dodge down. Oh, spot dodge, okay. Look at X. Look at Volkov actually. Oh my god. Oh. Nearly. That would have been clean if it did work. Uh, before we get into this quick plug, if you do enjoy my content and you're not already, consider subscribing. We're like 500 subs. Last time I checked, 9.5k off of 10k. So, um, yeah, it helped me out a lot. Get me closer to that goal. I really appreciate it. And even if you don't want to sub, you can like the video too. If you do go on to enjoy, that is. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. All right, I thought I'd record just a quick video today. Quick, because it's like 50 degrees Celsius outside. I'm probably quite close to death. Uh, I think the plants... Uh, are probably also close to death. I think the world's ending. It's it's quite hot, you know. Like usually we used to rain in the UK. We used to, you know, you know, just 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 horrendous weather, like miserable, depressing, um, just just all around not fun weather. But lately, uh, it's actually been quite hot. But uh, also because you know when we used to the, the extremely shit weather, it means that we uh, don't have AC in this country. Like no one actually has AC. Right, so when it actually gets really hot, um, it gets really hot. So yeah, um, I'm I'm kind of dying, and as well, like the fifty percent white in me has done me no favors. I'm I'm sunburnt, like that's not something that should be happening. But yeah, that happened, um, and all around, yeah, not not been not been the best of times. But at least it's sunny for once. Uh, that's that's all I really, uh, all I really care about at the end of the day. I can leave my house and do things outside. Wow, imagine Borala player touching grass, literally. But um, yeah, other news though, Volkov. I've definitely spread a bit, bit, bit misinformation in the past. I'm not gonna lie. I'll be the first one to admit, yeah, I was wrong. Cause I've been telling you lot. Oh, I, I say been telling. I made one video saying like this is why Volkov's useless. And basically, my point uh, summed up was that. Wait, can I make it? No, I can't make it back. But my point was that. He can't get, like, despite having all the decks, he can't even get the deck-specific two combos because he doesn't have enough decks, right? Which is, yeah, if you look at him like that, he's looking a bit useless. But, um, yeah, it turns out you can actually get the decks combos. You just have to run speed. Uh, the reason that you couldn't get the decks combos is because you don't have enough speed. Like, if you didn't know, the, the combo I'm speaking about is uh, N-Light, uh, Nair Ser, or specifically the Nair Ser bit, is true on high-deck side flashes, like Jiro, um, like that. But the thing is, is that you also have to have a certain amount of speed in order to be able to do that. Uh, or else, like, I don't know, you, you like your, your character, like, because it's such a tight combo that, like, if you don't have enough speed, your character just doesn't move fast enough to be where he has to be. Like, you'll be like a pixel off, right? So, yeah, that's why you need speed for that combo. And Volkov, despite having 7 million decks, has no speed at all. He's like my nan. So, unfortunately, that combo isn't true. However, someone in that comments, uh, that comment section even of that video where I said Volkov's useless, uh, told me that no, with a speed stance you can actually get just enough speed to hit, uh, and you can still only hit on high defense sessions. Like this hasn't saved Volkov by any any means at all, right? Don't ever get it twisted. Volkov is still ass, but it does make him better. Uh, I mean, Volkov's not ass. Like yes, his sigs are quite good, uh, especially Scythe. The Axe sigs. Mm. But the Scythe 6 is just broken. But um, yeah, you can actually get Nurse at you. It's just that you need the uh, need the speed stance on. I don't even know what the stats take off. You would have seen from the intro. I wasn't really paying attention. Uh, I just selected it. But I mean, we'll see now. Okay, so it takes off of attack, which is probably the worst thing to take off of. If it took off a of dex, it'd still work. Wait, why is King's Pass? <laughs> I'm not playing King's Pass. Well, there's no need for your card to sound like that anyway. Um, excuse the the um, automobile going past my house, but I don't know why, every single time a patch comes out, it resets your band map. Like, maybe BMG just are trying to get people to play King's Pass, because I don't know what other map you would ban. Let me know actually in the comments what map you have banned in Experimental. Uh, even if, you know, you might not have even known they could ban a map in Experimental, but um, you can. So, yeah, I, I would recommend getting rid of uh, King's Pass with speed, because that map is... It shouldn't even be a map, honestly. This map is also in contention for, for bands just because of how people can, you know, can play on it. Uh, and by can play on this map, you know what I mean. The people who will sit on this top platform for, for six out. Oh, see, and that's that, that's a Volkov tech right there. Stopping people 
doing exactly what I was saying, which is sitting on that top platform for six hours straight, not playing the actual game of Brawlhalla, but I don't know, playing that cookie clicker in the background or something instead. Like, they must be, right? But, yeah. Uh, you can do cool stuff on this map, though. I try to show it off. You can get, like, an unarmed clip, which I used to always go for on the channel until I realized that every single game of King's Pass... Oh, my King's Pass. What is this map? <laughs> not Thunder God. Thunder God is a map that, you know, should definitely be banned. But if you're a Katars player, I wouldn't even ban King's Pass. I'd ban Thunder God because you literally... There's that thing where you can't do side light, D light because side light sends downwards and then you go through the middle platform. Uh, I'm realizing the maps I'm speaking about, you lot might even know... Or might not, I can't actually speak at all. See, I have heat stroke, I swear. You might not even know the maps by name. So, um, yeah, uh, King's Pass is the one that obviously I, I was just on and left. Thunder God is the one with the platform in the middle that you've most likely SD'd on at some point in your Brawlhalla lifetime by just accidentally slightly holding down for like one millisecond as you go through the bottom of the map, uh, which is always fun. And you definitely don't feel cheap by the map. The fact that that used to be like tawny legal though is what really like just just hurts my brain. I don't understand. So did this map, but this map's more understandable. Like this map is more competitive than Thunder God. Why was Thunder God ever a tawny map? I I, I I feel bad for pro players back then. Honestly, I feel like BMG had uh, they've definitely leveled up in terms of um. Okay, why? I guess I just inputted it wrong. Thing is that combo. Uh, like Nair said, it feels so much easier to input on Jiro than it does Volkov. Like, maybe it's the speed. Maybe, like, it's easier with an extra point of speed over this, even. I don't know what it is. It's obviously not the decks, because Volkov has more decks, if anything. So, yeah, I'm not really too sure uh, what going with that. But, yeah, little... I could be get, like, a wall combo with Volkov, right? Like, if I hit an Ensig and put him against a wall with that... I don't think I can get anything off that, actually. I think I'm being a bit a bit dumb. Oh, we take those bounces. We do. Uh, you know, more time when you get hit with an actual recovery off stage like that. The bounce is never in your favor. It usually sends you straight down, actually. Uh, are these cars going past that day? Think, okay, look, the house I've moved to is literally... Outside my window is like a motorway. I'm like, <laughs> well, not a motorway, but it's a really, really busy road. And it's, uh, yeah, it's not fun, especially for, obviously, recording. But I, I don't really know what I can do about it, if I'm being honest. Well, I did hit him off the wall, and like I, uh, like I predicted, I got absolutely nothing off it. Jump. Okay. Oh, that kills. Wow. I do think Volkov is a very fun legend, though. And I think he does have a lot of potential, but it is just the decks that holds him back. Same with Jiro. But G I think Jiro is definitely better than Volkov, I can't lie. Uh, Jiro is getting better, a lot better. But I've talked about that already, so I'm not even going to like bore you and talk about it again. Um... But yeah, I was going to say something though. I'm not really sure. Oh yeah, X as well. I, I don't know if you lot saw, I think Atori might have too low defense for this combo to actually work. Which is quite a joke, I'm not going to lie. Like, if you didn't know as well, you can't do the, the Saifu combo, the, the Nessa, unless they have a certain amount of defense. Uh, which Atori might not have, I'm not sure. But um, we'll see. Anyway though, like I was saying, you're actually dead. Mm. Nearly. It would have been quite cheesy. But, um, yeah, I don't. I saw Sandstorm's tier list about, uh, like, the weapon tier list, even, not a legend one. Why is Axe the third best weapon in the game on his tier list? And why is Hammer so far down? This is what I've been saying this for, like, I've made literally, like, three videos talking about people, like, underrating Hammer. I know it's Sandstorm, but I honestly, I, I don't see how he could say that. Like, maybe he just knows something we all don't. He also had. Uh, he had like these brackets, and I also messed up that combo so hard. Oh my. Fem. He good. He, I'll let you get a weapon. I'll, I'll literally let you, if you just play normally, you can have a weapon. Uh, but anyway. He had like these brackets on the uh, tier list thing. Which meant that the weapons there, like in the brackets, were, were even in like, or equal in, in terms of balance is what he said. You've actually been murked. Okay. Well, that's what you get for being passive anyway. Um, and he had cannon and hammer in the same bracket. Which means he thinks cannon and hammer are equal in terms of strength. And uh, like, like I said, it's Sandstorm. You know, he is obviously a much different level than anyone else. Especially me. But um, 
Yeah, Cannon and Hammer being on the same, you know, same, uh, same level. Uh, I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one at all. But maybe we never know. I mean, he is quite a Cannon player, but I don't see how. Obviously, you have Hammer. D like Sarah will never drop once in your life. That's your kill option compared to Cannon, where your least consistent kill option, being side like Sarah, will drop a solid 70% of the time, and then your most consistent being D-Light Nair, will also drop quite a lot off of Gravity Cancel too, so it's... Yeah, I just don't see how they're equal, but like I said, it's Sandstorm. You, you just gotta allow him. You, you just let him, let him be, you know? Oh, I'm actually dead. Hold on. Oh, no, I'm not. He's giving me a second chance at life. Come on. <laughs> he probably shouldn't have done that. Because now I can... Oh. I was gonna say, now I can just side sig to death. But I guess not. Oh, wait. No. I haven't shown off enough side sigs at all, actually. He's not, he's, <laughs> he's not getting his kills off stage very effectively. I'm not going to lie. Oh. Okay. Um, I'm a bit scared. I'm a bit scared. I'm not going to lie. <sighs> oh, that's death. How's that not death? Wait. Okay. We take these. I am surviving for way too long though. I'm not even going to lie. I feel, I'm starting to feel a bit bad about this. Uh, <laughs> I, I, I think he kind of wants me to die. I might just, oh, oh, if he gets hit by one more of them, oh my god, <laughs> he's pissed, uh, let's be honest, I'd be pissed too, I think this actually might be the last game though, because, yeah, like I said, I'm, I'm actually dying, like, I don't think I can record, mm, maybe one more, but yeah, I've just been sat in this fucking oven of a room for the last, like, two hours debating, do I record, do I not record, I mean, obviously, you know the conclusion I came to, you, which is record, um, I'll let him get a weapon, uh, I think worth it. You know, it's not, it's not going too bad. Um, uh, like I said, little short recording. This will definitely be the last one. Uh, I thought I was going to make the last one the last one. But then, um, I thought, yeah. I, I can't be starving you of content that bad. I can't be shit house in a recording quite that heavily. I, I've got to play a bit more than that. But um, it, is, it is quite it is quite pain. I'm not going to lie. I'm feeling, uh, I'm feeling a bit dehydrated at the moment. Also, I, people who don't like the taste of water, what's wrong with you? Like, people will say, like, oh, I don't drink water, I don't like the taste. Water doesn't even have a taste, first of all. And second of all, you probably could die by the time you're, like, 40 years old. Like, drinking water, it's got to be done. Like, it just has to be done. If you don't like the taste, you just got to firm it. Or, like, put some lemons in the water. That is, that's actually quite a strep. Uh, like, if you have, like, disgusting tap water, and I'm not talking disgusting in terms of, like, you, you diet and you'll get, like, malaria. I'm talking disgusting in terms of it just doesn't taste nice, right? Not if it's coming out black. But, um, yeah, you can literally just, you know, have some uh, have some lemon in the water. Make it taste a bit better. Put some ice in there, too. I don't even know why I'm speaking about this, if I'm being honest. It's it's, it's not even relevant. Not, not, even, not even slightly relevant. Is this guy literally just unarming me? He actually is as well. I didn't even realize this entire time. He's been violating me. I, I'm blind to it. Uh, I feel a bit, um, feel like a bit of a dickhead at the moment. I'm not gonna lie. Dodge down. Oh, spot dodge. Okay. Look at Axe. Look at Volkov actually. Oh my god. Oh. Nearly. That would have been clean if it did work. I mean, obviously, it didn't. But uh, yeah, the thing is with Volkov, literally every single time I play him, I'm like, you know what? The search is actually really good. Like, uh, why do I think he's ass? And then, the next day, I'll be looking at the legend select screen. I'm like, obviously, oh, I'm, uh, I'm a cringe human being, so I'm going to pick a Scythe legend. And then I'm like, what Scythe legend do I play? I just instantly, I think, yeah, definitely not fucking, G not Jiro. Definitely not, uh, definitely not Volkov. And I don't know why. I don't know what changes in that, you know, time span where, you know, one second I'm like, oh yeah, this legend's actually really good. I take back everything bad I've ever said to, yeah, I'm definitely not playing Volkov at all. But, uh, maybe. Maybe they'll maybe change his decks one day and then I'll actually have no excuse and I'll, I'll become a Volkov main. Or, actually, yeah, I guess if, if they changed anyone's decks, it'd probably be Jira's. You don't really hear people complaining about Volkov's decks too much. Uh, whereas, you know, every single Jira player on the planet is crying about his decks 24s. So, there's that. Um, but maybe they change both. Maybe they both get a deck change. I'm... <laughs> I'm so close to saying sex change by accident. I am definitely saying dex change though. Don't demonetize me. Wait, that's not really even demonetizable, is it? It's um educational channel. Let's say yeah, it's a very educational channel. 
I've just taught you how to make uh, how to make water taste good. You don't learn that in school. Has has a school teacher ever told you to put lemons in your water? No, no, they have. That's why Larkland content is actually more beneficial to youth than uh, than school. And that's just my opinion, though. Uh, you, you you don't have to don't have to listen to me unless I lose this game. Then you probably shouldn't ever listen to anything I say again, because. Uh, oh, oh, the recovery. There was no need for that uh, for that dare to hit on stage. Oh my god. He just, he actually thought he could violate me. Like that. Like that. No way. No way. Oh. Oh, he actually might be dead from that. Okay, we take those. Anyway, like I said, I'll probably end it there before I do die of heat stroke. But, um, hope you lot have enjoyed. Wait, I just realized we played that Cassidy first game, though. Literally, uh, my words just trailed off into nothing right then. Like I said, I'm, I'm actually dying. But anyway, um, if you did enjoy, leave a like, subscribe. Uh, it helped me out a lot. I really appreciate it. But until next time, have a great day and peace.